What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Different, and welcome to Difference World. And for today's vlog, I'm very excited because before the first year, 2022's travel vlog, we're going to be starting off with my trip to Panama. Um, I did this trip back in when December 2017. I had a really good time. Uh, visited the uh, Panama Canal, uh, Old Panama, um, the Bayou Museum. I think I did Monkey Island. I got attacked by some monkeys, as you guys will see when you check out the video. Uh, also, full disclosure, um, some of my little videos are a little janky. I had to get some of them from my old Instagram account, so you'll see me recording, showing you a video of a recorded um, little clip from my Instagram page. Um, nonetheless, it's still my videos. Um, so check it out, uh, and I'll come back on once the video is done, and you know I'll hit you guys up for what's going on with Difference World. So check out my travel vlog to my trip and my adventures to Panama City in uh, Panama, and hope you guys enjoy. Thank you. 
They eat for lunch or for food, they eat normally the iguanas. They eat iguanas for lunch? Yeah, they eat for family. For family. Do they do that now? Why? I gotta watch out. You know what, the other day I ate something that did taste a little funny. I don't know. Africans 
most of them came from Congo. Just so y'all know. Tell the history. Like say if a like a, a fleet comes through and they get stuck like in the marsh, they just yeah. like nobody would come and help them out. Like if they get stuck out here, yeah. no. nobody would come. No. Wow. So damn. Oh, I see. Oh man, that's messed up. Quarter double Panama. You went to Mira Flores in the Pacific Ocean, got to meet the Caribbean. Ah. Can you see? I see. What's well, <laughs> I know, right? All that water come in. I'm looking at a flock up there, if you guys can see. My other video got deleted. I'm so mad. It's a really good thing. Had really good info in it.
puta de ofender a este Tiny Leaf. Ahí está. Ahí está. You got anything else for me? You said he's a greedy one. Oh, look at that one. Missing out on all the actions. Como se dice monkey in español? Molas? Monos. His name is Jeffrey. Yeah. <laughs> Where are the other ones? Bye. So the first one we seen were what white face monkeys? Yeah, the first one that we saw white face.
Hey guys, welcome back. I hope you guys enjoy watching my adventures in Panama City. Um, I had a really, really good time, as you guys can see. Um, yeah, visiting the Panama Canal and a uh, little trip to Monkey Island. As y'all seen, the monkeys, <laughs> they were so greedy and they attacked me for uh, my bananas. And so I just had to let them have it. Um, what are some other places? I forgot to mention, um, as you've seen the video, I actually got to go to the casinos. But you're not allowed to take pictures in the casino. So um, I took some pictures outside. Um, so I did some gambling when I was out out there um yeah and so that was a really good time for me it rained a lot as well so i wasn't able to do as much um but for what it was worth i had a really good time um let's see what else uh is going on in different spoils i hope you guys enjoyed uh previously you know this week i just uh posted um my mlk day video so i hope you guys enjoyed that vlog and you know you're sharing that and you're you're commenting on though that video as well um also, you know, hope you guys enjoyed watching um, uh, my podcast interview with Miss Juanita Harris. I did uh, back in October 2021. Had a very good time with her. Um, so I finally got the sound bit for that. And I um, hope you guys enjoyed watching that podcast video. And as you guys can see, we talked a lot about my new book. Dun, da, da, da. What If a Controversial Paradigm Shift. This book, again, written to encourage thought-provoking conversations about injustice and systemic racism in America. And it's done through graphic and provocative illustrations. So, again, be advised that this is a grown folks-only type of book. And so, if you can't take that type of heat, then don't bother coming to this kitchen. Um, but for what it's worth, I'm getting a lot of good reviews and good sales. And so, I do appreciate that. You know, people are showing their support and love. And it's just keep going up, 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 up. And that's just what we're about here at Third Eye Entertainment. You know, like I said, you're on that come up like Cardi B or that come back like Robert D. There is no more in between. And so um, with that being said, you guys, like I said, me personally, what I'm going through, um, dealing with the loss of my mother, you know, she died in my arms the day after Christmas of 2021. And so, um, like I said, you know, here at Third Eye, we, we try to, you know, talk about issues that are taboo and often swept under the rug and in the black community you know we don't talk about you know our mental health status and how we're doing or if we're depressed or anything in that nature and i just vowed to be you know that black girl that's just not gonna hide it anymore and if i got issues you know i need to fix it i'm gonna be i know i, I realize it's not everybody's business but you know i know it's people out there that will feel me and understand where i'm coming from and it lets me know that i'm not alone so with that being said anybody out there that's going through any type of depression or you know suffering the loss of a loved one you know just know it's okay to not be okay but don't sit there and not be okay for me um <clears throat> i call it grieving healthy grieving if you will you know i'm i'm taking unnecessary steps you know that i should be taking to you know help process the fact that my mother is no longer here with me and she will no longer be here with me from here on out it's a hard pill to swallow and it's still kind of, it's very hard to believe that she is gone. I wouldn't have believed it had I not have been there for myself, but me and my brother, we were right there by her side when she took her last breath. And so that's how I know that it's real. Um, and I'm, I'm hurting without her, but I would rather hurt than her, you know, to be in pain and I'm, I'm happy that she's no longer suffering and I know she's in a better place and I know she's shining <laughs> down that sun, you know, blinding me, you know, she, she's looking down on me and she's just telling me, you know, keep going, you know, do what you're supposed to do and do what you told me you were going to do. And so that's what it is for me, you guys, you know, here in Difference World, everything ain't always so peachy keen, you know, I'm sharing, you know, all of the, you know, good, you know, accomplishments I've had in life, but I still go through things just like everybody else. And so, you know, with that being said, you know, I'm not perfect, you know, I do, you know, have my hangups and I go through things just like everybody else. And so, you know, before I even make it to the top, I want you guys to see me and know that this is being what you see is what you get. And, you know, I'm going to try to keep it humble, you know, from beginning, middle and end. Um, and so with that being said, I hope, you know, it inspires other to, you know, be open and upfront about, you know, their mental health issues. Now, again, not going to tell everybody your business while well, I, I understand me putting this video out here, you know, to the world, you know, some people, you know, some things, you know, you just shouldn't hide. And so that's what it is for me. And so with you guys out there that's listening, you know, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel, you know, and see more of what's going on in Difference World when you come and learn and, and you see, you know, what we are about here at Third Eye Entertainment, LLC. And so um, 
thank you so much to you, uh, everybody out there that's watching my videos through Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, you know, my website, people that's ordering my book, What If a Controversial Paradigm Shift, da 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 da, don't forget, it's out and about on my website, differenceworld.net. Uh, thank you guys so much, and so, and don't forget, um, whatever it is in life that you want, you have to manifest, plan, and prepare for it, and it will surely come to you guys. Peace. Difference World, come and learn. What if? What if in 1619 Africans started dealing in slave trading? The tables were turned around. What if they kidnapped millions of Englishmen, women, and children from their homeland and brought them to America on a slave ship? What if a controversial paradigm shift? It's a book written to inform and encourage consistent, thought-provoking conversations about injustice and systematic racism in America. Through graphic but provocative illustrations, What If provides a different perspective by detailing controversial deaths and events as four categorized paradigm shifts, historical, political, precedent, and hypothetical. What If, a controversial paradigm shift by author different 